After living in upstate New York most of my life, I moved to western Massachusetts and then from western Massachusetts to Tucson, Arizona, which was a happy accident. We expected to only stay in the desert for a few years, but ended up falling in love with it and wanted to make it our permanent home. And it's a pretty magical place to live. It's so beautiful here. The weather is amazing, and Tucson is really a big, small town. People are super friendly. There's just great things to do here. The trails are incredible. Uh, the University of Arizona is here, which is a really great place to spend time and go to lectures and cultural events, things like that. And there's just natural beauty everywhere that you look. You don't need to get dressed up to go to dinner, and it's a really casual town. Building relationships with my clients is something that is very fulfilling to me, getting to know them, what they're all about, and helping them from the start to the end of their journey and then thereafter is what I love about this business. This business is about people. It's about taking care of people, getting to know people. It's about community. Restline Sotheby's International Realty has the most amazing charitable foundation and I have the fortunate position of being on the advisory committee for Tucson. People from all over the globe are attracted to our brand and our listings. I have a personal passion for these things and get really excited about interesting homes and design elements and love helping people see what could be in a space and it's just a unique skill that I have. One of the things I love to do with buyer clients is show them Tucson because I love Tucson so much and it's really fun to get them excited about it too if they haven't been here before. So I've mapped out this little route that I take people on and it has interesting stops along the way and it's so fun to see people get excited about the area and have these moments of surprise and delight. So usually I start the tour at Long Cantata in the foothills we will go down to St. Philip's Plaza. We'll stop at the Loop, which is this incredible 135 mile paved multi-use path throughout Tucson, one of the great amenities of the area. And we will go over to see Sabino Canyon, which is a really incredible and powerful place to see the mountains from that vantage point. People get really excited about that. I love to trail run, which is something that I started doing here when I moved to the desert. I was always a road runner on the East Coast. That's what you do there and then discover the trails here, which are just incredible and give you this reboot that is so different. My zen is out there on the trails. That's where I find my peace.